Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Global Financial Leaders Investment Summit. I am Andrew Work, and I will be your master of ceremonies as we navigate beyond uncertainty. Now, of course, the future is always uncertain, but of late, the twists and turns of economics and geopolitics have been coming fast and furious. And so I hope that you at least were able to take some respite from the maelstrom last night at M+, a new landmark on the Hong Kong and Asian art scenes and a sign of Hong Kong's commitment to developing arts and culture for the region. Now, storms and typhoons, they come and they go. But for almost 200 years, one city has negotiated these turbulent times and come out on top, and that city is Hong Kong. And so it's only appropriate that we welcome you here today to Asia's financial center so you can take stock of the global environment with a little bit of Hong Kong perspective. Now, one rock in stormy waters has been Hong Kong's famously stable monetary system. And so we now welcome to you the leader of the steward of Hong Kong's monetary and regulatory system, the chief executive of the Hong Kong Monetary Authority. Please welcome Mr. Eddie Yu. Good morning, friends. Welcome to the Global Financial Leaders Summit. Uh, and for friends coming from all over the world, we welcome you to Hong Kong again, and thanks so much for coming all the way back to Hong Kong. And I hope that by now, after reconnecting with your friends and associates and business contacts here, you will see that Hong Kong is open and we are back. And uh, thank you. And we have a saying in Chinese that, uh, in the, the translation is like this, uh, where the dignitaries travel, the storms follow. <laughs> so I see the wind and rain outside, uh, and, but I think it's an acknowledgement of the very important role that you all are playing in the global financial sector. So it's really great to see you here. And it's the first time that the HKMA hosts a summit of this kind, in fact, any event of this scale. So if there's anything that we did not do right, let us know. But when we searched for the right theme uh, for the summit, one word kept coming in, uh, and that's uncertainty. If you look around the world of finance, all kinds of uncertainties uh, come in. Stagflation rates, uh, interest rate increase, geopolitics, the lingering pandemic, climate, disruptive technology is an appallingly long list, but not to mention the many unknown unknowns. And now, even with the summit on, last night we were dealing with one big uncertainty, the storm, the weather, the typhoon, uh, but we weathered through it. Some of these uncertainties are, of course, transitories, but some are more sticky. So the billion question to us all is, how can we definitely navigate the more immediate challenges and opportunities, and also keep an eye on the long term. For example, sustainability and technology are two major global trends that we are seeing, uh, which is affecting all aspects of the world around us, and of course finance is no exception. So how we handle them will determine the success or failure of our organizations in the years and decades to come. And given the power of finance, what we do collectively will have broader repercussions to the global community and also our future generations. So with these issues and questions in mind, I look forward to the very inspiring uh, discussions today and also the collective wisdom that will be brought by some of the brightest minds in global finance today. And I look forward to it and I hope you will all enjoy the summit today. Thank you very much. Thank you, very, thank you very much, Mr. Yu, for setting the stage for us today.